today we have soft trail, warm condition. Uh, we're heading back towards the kennel, but we stop uh, in the tippy again on the way back home and where we have lunch. <coughs> the same place where we have lunch the first day. Now I have to work. We are Stina and Matti. We run a lifestyle company in the north of Swedish Lapland. For a living, we work as nature guys and dog mushers. This is our life, our dream and our home. You're welcome to follow us on the journey. Morning routines in the tent, stuffing the sleeping bags and packing everything together after breakfast and it's actually fighting down the sleeping bag in the bag. Yes. <laughs> it's not the easiest thing. There's a lot of air in them. Nice to stand up. Yeah. Now the sleds are packed, ready to go, and now we put harness on the dog, take away the anchor, and then go. This moment when you start dressing the dogs and they start getting a little bit stressed. I have co we have calm dogs, but it's not my favorite. That is Gandalf. 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 That's a young one, Gandalf. This is his first season, one and a half year old. So he have done now his first overnight tour. First night was a little bit stressful for him, but now the last two nights he have been sleeping very well. Gandalf. He just wanna run. Now we have just made some uphill 
it's hard work to run. <sighs> Here, Louis coming. The first team behind me, and then Titi, Sonia, and Omar after. Over there, you can see the lake where we were. Day number two, Purkiar. Now, Titi is coming to. <sighs> nice with some exercise. Is it nice with exercise? <laughs> You're not cold. <laughs> now we. It's some soft snow on the trail, and we going back to our kennel. We have just we have just a few kilometers left to our tipi. Where are we going to have coffee and barbecue and eating something? And then we take the last stretch back to the canal and finish this tour. The dogs are doing super fine this week and the young ones have um, calmed down a lot. I'm super happy with Gandalf because he, he was quite uh, this autumn, when we start training him, he was a little bit naughty. <laughs> he was, he gave me some grey hair. Actually, I don't have so much hair left, but the few hairs I have left on my head turned greyish, probably from him or falling off. I don't know. A little bit tired of uh, Gotte and. Gandalf, because they are not relaxing. Gandalf. <sighs> At least it's <laughs> it's very nice that we don't have mosquitoes here. No mosquitoes. Now he's doing much much better. And this was his first camping trip and the first night he was holding a little bit and made some noise. He was not comfortable, but the last night he was super, super calm, super nice, like a normal dog. Cooking! Don't destroy my glove again. Oh. Stop, stop. Uh, <laughs> Can you sing to the yolk? No, I can't. <laughs> and if I try, you will run away. <laughs> it is the lingonberry. I don't typically like that. coffee. Yes, please. I film when I first we had to put this out. <laughs> no. okay. The first yeah. because it's some for the homies. Yeah, for the. You said homies. <laughs> for our homies, yeah. <laughs> In uh, <laughs> thanks. Okay. That's good.
you enjoy what you have seen and um, now you can subscribe us down here and follow us on youtube facebook instagram if you like this uh, if you don't like it you can just continue to the next channel <coughs> We had a nice tour and it was super nice clients that follow me out this week and I'm already looking forward to next tour. Ciao!